Hi, this is Sandy Joe from RhinestoneTemplates.com, and I made a previous video that showed you with my butterfly tribal multicolor uh, butterfly how to take and, and separate all the colors to send to um, to a cutter if you did not have WinPC sign or um, if you wanted to just go ahead and cut it separated out in the different templates. You can also do this another way um, in 2010 or in 2012 um, WinPC and um, I just brought, I just imported my design back into my frame here and I'm just going to go up to the shape tool hit my break all so I have each little um, any dot and I just checked it and they're all separated out so I'm just going to go ahead and marquee this and I'm going to send this um, up to my cutter which is the the cutting little tool up here the little pin you click that and when you do that um, it's going to ask you if you have extra shapes that you want to erase and and you can go in and do that if you want to and I do have some extra stuff here but for the for the video let's just go ahead and um, I'll show you if you are going to select by color and and cutting the different things let's just pick out the the aqua blue color and you can just take that then send that to your cutter and it will cut just that one color um, in my passes I always have two passes selected in my win PC so I do two rotations so it's two 360s which makes a a complete 720 so you don't have anything holding your template little boogers into your your material and when you weed it weeds off a nice easy weed I also when I cut I cut on um, either my black or my red cutting mats so I take off my sticky flock material or my green rubber material and stick it straight down on my um, my mats and send them to my cutters so that when I'm done with my um, putting in my two rotations up here and selecting the colors that I want to cut um, then I go ahead and um, when I'm I'm done I, I pull them off and all of my little template circles are gonna stay behind but as I was talking I just went through and I was just showing you how each color is gonna just show up you know on its own to cut by color if you want and that way you don't have to do registration marks or um, anything like that if you don't want but if you still want for lining up purposes to put the registration marks on you can do that too and we'll do another video on showing you how to do the registration marks but um, I hope this helps and um, if you have any questions this is Sandy Joe at rhinestonetemplates.com um, if we can help you with any rhinestone supplies or any information just let us know um, I purchased and I recommend purchasing your rhinestone template uh, or your rhinestone design software the WinPC 2012 from Roger at www.heatpressvinyl.com um, and the reason for that is he has a forum for support to back that up and I'm a part of that and I help do the videos and and there's a lot of members on there I think we're close to 600 members um, to help each other and figure out how to use the software in many different ways and the website for the support for that is um, winpcsign2010.com and if you need any help with um, you know any of the software anything we'd be glad to help you thank you